So I thought I'm gonna be smart this time and start packing already, but I suck at it, obviously. So I'm probably just gonna do it tomorrow. Okay, so it's the next morning and I'm ready to fly to Paris. I think I'm pretty much packed. Let's do this. Okay, it was a bit stressful, but I kind of made it to the airport. Got my passport, ticket, and I'm ready for Paris. Welcome to this lens crew vlog in case I'm the first one who's making a video. It's currently 11 p.m. Uh, my bus leaves at 2 a.m. I still have to pack my stuff, do my makeup because let's be real, no one's gonna be mad Nadia like this. Um, do my makeup, get my stuff, do my hair, get my outfit, and hopefully be on time for my bus. So, wish me luck. Hey guys, um, I'm Lisa and I'm part of Lens Crew. Um, it's currently Saturday, uh, December 16th and um, I've 
finished packing um, and I think yeah I finished packing I just need like my charger and my ear pods but that's stuff I'm gonna pack tomorrow morning um, the only thing I gotta do tonight is shower and um, tomorrow morning I'm leaving the house at quarter to seven so that means I'll see you guys tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. bye hey guys me again it's um, 11 30 so 30 minutes later I am still puzzled on my outfit it's either gonna be this Dua Lipa merch or this yellow shirt and the people of Twitter are not being very helpful because in my poll they each have an equal amount of percent so thanks very much for that um, see you later probably with an emotional breakdown going on or some stuff so adios what's up guys it is 1am and I'm about to leave oh my god I am so excited my heart is my heart is about to burst with happiness and um, I don't even care that I have to get on a flicks bus for six hours I mean, I do care, but it's worth it because I'm seeing Nadia and I'm seeing Lisa and I'm seeing Marnie and I'm seeing two Carolines. So beat that. Okay, I'm out because I don't want to miss my bus. Bye.
Are you ready? No, I really don't want to go. <laughs> you still don't want to go? No. Why not? Yeah, you I, want to go. I think that's I a beautiful want to go. I know, right? I'm a bit scared. I'm not your hillcoat. It's gonna be like, fuck off, bitch. You're more annoying than. <laughs> that's hard. <laughs> Please put that in the vlog. Cause I hate. <laughs> <laughs> Please let me know. <laughs> I love that so much. Hey, I'm emotional and I'm gonna cry. Because I have to cry today and I'm very proud of myself. But it's not gonna stay that way. It's gonna be like that before every convention. Just I'm literally a bit like shaky. Yeah, same like get a grip on thing. Okay, we're on our way to the hotel. To the convention. Are you nervous? I'm not nervous, I'm just excited. I am Are you nervous? nervous? Because I don't know what pose I'm gonna do. Oh god, don't and remind me. I have okay, never done, I've, I've I've never done a meeting room, so I'm terrified. And she's dying. <laughs> she's just straight I up dying. I'm gonna cry like Tiffany. What about you? I have no idea what pose I'm gonna do. Oh, don't look at Oh my god. Are we here? We're I here. And she was like, wait, I'm gonna stop. Oh my god. And she was like, how are you doing? I'm so stressed. Don't be stressed. I'm stressed. I'm stressed. I told her I'm going to women. Space walkers and survival and to lose. And she got so happy and I wanna kill myself. Is it my turn? Yes, it is. Okay, so I was walking to photo ops and she was outside having a cigarette and then I hear someone go, Oh, you! And I turn around, it's Nadia Hilka because, oh, of course, you. she's obsessed with me. Um, <laughs> and then, of course. And then I go to walk away from her because who the fuck is Nadia Hilka? Chicken. Um, I, I go towards her and she um, licks me into a hug and then she's like, I miss you so much, I love you. And I was like, I know, everyone misses me. And then, yeah, we just hugged for the longest time and I went to pull away and she was like, Nope, I'm staying here, this is me. And I was just like, I love you so much. And that is my story. Retweet to share. <laughs> I've been to Paris for Nadia and I haven't recovered yet. <laughs> Just, it's now Thursday and I'm still not recovered. Nadia Hilka is the angel that we as humans do not deserve because oh my god literally just she has so much time for every single person that she encounters and she loves every single person that she meets and i just love her so much she is the greatest person in all of the world ever at the meeting everyone ended up crying and she ended up giving pep talks to every single person in the room and i just got really emotional what i don't usually get but i started crying and she came over and like held up my face and was like, you're strong, you're beautiful and I was like you and you can get through this and... And literally the whole weekend, or the whole day even, I just wanted to show her and be like, you're doing amazing, sweetie, because she was. Like, she's an amazing person. She really cares about all of us. I think Monday she posted this long ass Instagram post where she was like, to all the, in brackets, my amazing girls and was talking about how happy it makes her to see all of us unite and be there for each other and have each other's backs. 
and she's honestly just such a wonderful person and I'm just so thankful for everything that happened and for Nadia and for my friends and Caro Squared and me and Lisa and everybody else I met oh my god they were all just so amazing and the 48 hours in Paris was so worth it even though me and Caro stayed in the worst hotel I've ever stayed in I think I have legitimate insect bites from sleeping there but you know life goes on I'm so glad I flew over even if it was for less than 48 hours in Paris for her and I can't wait to see her again in like, what, what is it, 45 days? I love Nadia Hilker, I love my friends, I'm hyped for survival and we are grounders and spacewalkers and everything, so that's pretty much it, bye.